So I started back here and I got this in uh, by starting it flat on the flat side here and pushing it up as far as I could uh, using a mix of water and soap in a squirt bottle as lubricant on both the aluminum here uh, and on the uh, on the rubber. And after I got that up as far as I could, I started pushing in this outer lip, uh, again, using soap and water. So let me zoom in here. So you're kind of pressing in the inner lip and then this outer lip just kind of folds in well lubricated. Yep. And so here's a part that hasn't gone in yet. You can see there's the right tooth, the part that goes in to the slot. And just gently, and then, and then whoop, goes right in. Goes right in. And squeeze that down inside the car. And you can just see, watch my fingers roll over the top and push it in. Maybe one or two passes, but it just folds in for you. Yep, just like that. One pass over it up the inside, second pass gets the outside. Wow. So how long do you think it took you to get that corner done? Because this entire bottom took, what, 30 seconds? Uh, you know, that was a couple minutes to get it started in down here because the gap is a little wider Yeah. in the trim here. And it did require quite a bit of lubrication and pressure to slide it up. All right, so. Okay, so what I've done is I've got one finger behind the rubber lip and my fingernail is against the metal of that, you know, the vertical piece. And I push down with my thumb and just kind of let it squeeze in. And so now I pull down on the lip to get it back and, you know, to get it to slide down and then move my thumb along so and that's the fat channel just wrapping around that metal metal lip yeah all right cool all right thank you